I came here from the United States of America to stand for freedom with all free people against the forces of oppression and darkness that you all are representing. I came here in order to stand with the people who are fighting for the freedoms that make it possible for you to do what you are doing today, not the violence and hatred, but to stand in dissent. But you can't stand to have any kind of rational discussion. You can't stand any dissent. You have to try to throw bottles and drown us out because you are cowards because you know that you stand on nothing except oppression and darkness and hatred. And that is why you were there. And that is why I am here. You are fronting for the most radically intolerant and hateful ideology on the planet, everywhere in the world, everywhere in the world where there are Muslims and non-Muslims, there is conflict because the Muslims attack the non-Muslims. The Quran teaches to make war against the unbelievers and to subjugate them. And you're already subjugated. You're already their useful idiots. You're already their tools. You are out here in their service. And you think you're fighting for freedom. And you are fighting for your own slavery. You are fighting for your own enslavement. And it will come. It will come to you. You are fighting for an ideology that denies the freedom of speech. And one day, it will, you will wish you had the freedom of speech that you are trying to fight against today. You are fighting against an idea, you are fighting, you are fronting for an ideology that denies the freedom of conscience and will kill you if you disagree, which is exactly what you want to do already. You are fighting on behalf of an ideology that denies equality of rights for women and all the women among you will one day be enslaved if you get what you want. You are fighting for the destruction of all the freedoms that you enjoy. You are fighting for the utter defeat of your own selves and your own life. You are slaves seeking slavery. You are the oppressed loving your oppression and thinking that you are standing for freedom. You are the most foolish, you are the most evil, foolish people on earth. We are standing for the human rights of all people, of the oppressed Christians in Indonesia, in Pakistan, in Egypt, in the Sudan that we just heard about. We are standing for the oppressed people who are t targeted by Islamic Jihad everywhere around the world, in Israel, everywhere around the world. And so, in closing, I have to say, shame on you.